Okay, everybody, I have another radio video. Um, I just wanted to put this up because this is something really fun that you can do um, to be able to send pictures back and forth with just an old old cell phone, well, relatively old, um, or a current cell phone. Or if you have an old phone and you have a current phone, then you have two. And if you have two radios, you can send pictures back and forth just through the radios, not using any, not using any cell towers, not using any Wi-Fi. Um, this could come in handy as a way to be able to send information across a distance um, if you have good line of sight in areas where there is no cell cell service. This is a just read it, but this is a this is a a mode called SSTV or slow scan TV, and it allows you to send images over UHF, right? So we're used to streaming images over uh, Wi-Fi, which is about 2.54 gigahertz gigahertz, right? So what we're talking about is like uh, about one, four, five megahertz. So much, much lower frequency, much, much lower bandwidth. So the picture is gonna, it's gonna come across line by line. Actually, it's gonna, it's gonna slowly appear, right? So it's like the old 300 modems, whatever. So, um, so this is something you can do um, with just a tech license uh, with, with ham radio. There's, there's three different levels. There's tech, there's general. There's extra. This is for people that don't know anything about ham radio, or for people that just got their tech license. Um, it's just a 35-question test. costs $15. If you get enough right, you pass, and then you have a technician's license. You can get a a ham radio. That the the best one I think is to get in the beginning is a Baofeng UV5R. And I know a lot of people knock the Baofeng UV5Rs. They're only $25 or $27 shipped on Amazon Prime. And uh, you know a lot of radio snobs or people have different preferences. I certainly have different preferences too. I like Yesu. Some people like Icom. Those are certainly awesome brands, and uh, you'll get better radios. But for the money, for twenty-five dollars, for what you get with a Baofeng, you just can't beat it. Show me somewhere else where you spend twenty-five dollars and get the functionality you get with a Baofeng UV5R. So I'll just leave that there. You know, you, you want to spend another, you know, three hundred dollars on a handheld and get uh, GPS and APRS and uh, you know all these other features in here and better filters. Sure, of course you will. Of course it's a better radio. But what I'm going to show you is just with a twenty-five dollar radio, it's something that's <clears throat> fun to do with the kids or fun to maybe use as an application. If you could find used to send pictures across a distance. Uh, where there's no cell service. <clears throat> so there's two different there's two different applications you're going to want to down to your smartphone. Um, one of them is called SSTV, which just stands for Slow Scan TV. That's that's the uh, kind of the the mode we're going to be using. And then the other application is called Robot 36. And there's a bunch of sub modes that you can use in there. There's like Scotty One, Scotty Two. There's Robot 36. There's Robot 72. We're going to be using Robot 72 because it has a little bit better contrast. Takes a little longer, but it has better contrast. And I'm just going to send a picture of myself from one radio to the other. Okay. So once you have these programs downloaded to your cell phone, you don't need Wi-Fi. You don't need cell service. So this could be done with uh, phones that don't have SIM cards, um, which is really cool to be able to repurpose an old phone and use it for this. One of the things you could use it for. Um, yeah. So so they're free. You download them. Slow scan TV. Robot 36. I'm going to post links in this video uh, about, and the only other two things you need is a $25 radio, the Baofeng UV5R, and a cable that connects to the Baofeng and then just to the stereo jack of your phone. And it's like five or 12 bucks. So in this whole thing, it's probably like 35 bucks it's going to cost you to do this. If you have a phone, which most people do, um, then that's about all it's going to cost to be able to do this. So. I'm just going to grab this here. We're going to go over here. I'm going to show you what I have going on. So what I have here is I have two smartphones, right? This is my old phone. This is the phone I'm currently using. I have two radios here. These are Baofeng UV5Rs. These are $25 radios I was talking about. And this is just a simple cable you can buy that plugs into your phone, plugs into the jack of the UV5R radio, and then plugs into your standard headphone stereo jack of your phone. And we're just going to dial up on a UH frequency. I have this third radio here just to monitor. You don't need this third radio. I just have this here so you can hear the sound of what it sounds like when we send a message uh, from this radio to this radio. What I'm going to do is I'm going to turn this phone on and I'm going to select 
a picture inside of the app SSTV and then what it's going to do when I hit send it's going to encode it it's going to encode this picture line by line into tones which it's going to broadcast over this radio this radio is going to pick it up and this app robot 36 is going to decode these tones and then start to display the picture from this phone to that phone so I'm just going to go in here actually I'm going to enter in my code you don't see that and uh, I already have this this here pre-selected but but what you can do is you can just open this up you're gonna see like this old school like when the TVs used to go off air you'd see this at night you're gonna see that multicolor thing on here and you're gonna go ahead oh one thing make sure that these radios have to be on Vox mode um, so it's like menu 4 if you go into the menus here you go to number 4 you select down select I like to select about halfway in Vox you could probably do 10 um, it goes from 1 through 10 or off. Those are the options with the Vox, but it just allows it to pick up uh, messages through here or, or sounds through here to, to activate the transmitter or the receiver. So make sure both of these radios are on Vox mode. Plug it in. So I'm going to go in here. Make sure that this is the same mode. It says Robot 72. Robot 72. And you can go in here and you can select different modes. Just make sure they're the same so it encodes and decodes the same way. So I'm going to go in here, I'm going to select the picture, I'm just going to select a picture of myself, it brings it up in the queue, and uh, when I hit play here, you should hear the tone and we'll start seeing the picture propagate over here. So there it is, this sending bar here will start growing, you'll see it to start moving across the screen, and what it's doing is it's encoding this picture. And this phone is decoding this picture. So this could be a good way to send information to another person with just using radios and a cell phone that has no service. This, this radio is in transmit, see the red light? This radio is receiving. And you, you would normally not hear anything. I just have this one on to monitor the same frequency. You wouldn't hear anything. You would just see it happening, right? So, I'll turn this back on so you can hear when it's over. And when this gets all the way over to the end, you'll know that it's done sending the picture. But there it is, it's pretty good contrast. You can totally make out who that is. Um, let's see. And there it is, it sent the picture. And then you can go ahead and save this picture, and it'll save it onto your phone. So, that's just a mode that I wanted to show you guys. I'm going to post links um, in this video. So, for 35 bucks and a couple, an old smartphone and a current one, you can uh, start encoding and decoding messages and sending them over UHF.